What's up guys, welcome to new Unreal Engine 5 video. Today we're checking out the free for the month assets for this month of June. We have amazing assets this month, so let's go ahead and check them out. So first of all, we have the Science Fiction Valley Town. I mean, just look in this first picture, it looks amazing. Let's go ahead and just hit play on the video. It reminds me of a kind of a Star Wars planet, right? I mean, it looks pretty cool. I think that some unique games come, come out from this. I mean. Instantly what I think of is, you know, Star Wars Jedi or something like that. And I think that you can come up with pretty cool gameplay experiences with this really cool environment. It's like having sci-fi bases inside of the mountains in a strange planet. I like I like it. Honestly, you know, I would add this into my library without any um, hustle. Alright, so next up we have the Ultimate Weapon Customization System Plus Stylized Futuristic Set. Wow, okay, so basically, this system, I mean, look at this picture, allows you to customize your weapon with attachments and things like that. So let's go ahead and also hit play in the video. As you can see, we have like uh, this kind of weapon presets, and we can go ahead and go into this customization menu, where we can start to play around and overall, you know, customize the weapon, which seems... Pretty cool, I mean, wow. This has a lot of um, kind of details, as you can see, damage, fire rate, accuracy, reload time, clip size, range. I mean, honestly, you can come up with a very, very, very complex, uh, you know, shooter combat system with this asset pack over here. I mean, it will really facilitate your creation on leveling and overall modifying weapons and runtime and things like that. I mean, you know, I, I would recommend to add this into a library. I don't know if, you know, someone would actually use it in a real game because of the complexity that I think this package will come from. But overall, definitely add this to your library without any doubt. All right. So next up, we have one of my favorite, which is the Lookout Tower. I mean, look how beautiful this scenery looks. Uh, let's go ahead and click play in the video too. It reminds me of Firewatch, you know, this pretty cool game. But of course, now we are going with the realistic graphics in Unreal Engine 5 rather than stylus, right? I mean, I can think of really cool games on this, you know? Or like you're a, like Firewatch, you know? You're a Firewatch, um, you know, how, how you said, like agent, <laughs> right? And you're like taking care of the forest and you're in your cabin taking missions and so on. I think that it would be pretty cool to make a, a maybe like a kind of dead look, right? On, on that, that would be cool. But yeah, you can see that it looks amazing. It comes with the forest, it comes with the tower. Really add this to the library right now. Okay, so next up we have the low poly Viking top down interior. And let's go ahead and click play on the video. You can see that it comes with this stylized low poly kind of top-down environment on this Viking aesthetic. It looks cool. I mean, I don't think it looks, you know, out of this world and or look crazy, crazy, you know, super cool, but it does look very good. Um, it has a low poly aesthetic, you know, using, of course, uh, looming and so on. So I think that it is pretty cool, um, but, you know, nothing crazy from the other world, but probably you can use it in your games very 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 easily so that's cool add that into our library once again totally free and last but not least we have one of my also favorite ones which is the adventures inventory kit let's just go press play because you will you will like explode of emotion because this reminds me so much of assassin's creed i mean i think that the ui is like like a copy of assassin's creed pretty much but that's the cool thing, you know? I mean, this could be cool to integrate it into my Unreal Engine 5 RPG uh, series, right, guys? But, yeah, of course, <laughs> we're not doing that. But you get the idea. Um, overall, like, this comes with this, you know, uh, mouse movement for gamepad. We have the different slots. We have the different legendary, mythic, and rare kind of, uh, you know, common item styles. We have, you know, all this kind of data that goes up. We can move the character around, as you can see. It is so complete, so complex. I mean, I don't know how complex it will be to add it and integrate it to your own project, your own game right now, but it does seem very, very neat, and probably things will be straightforward to add. But yeah, I mean, if you're doing like an RPG game, this will be very, very useful. If not, you can follow my RPG series where, you know, we have a simple <laughs> um, approach to this inventory system. But yeah, um, this will definitely save a lot of people's lives and make your game look more, um, you know, I guess 
tree boy we could say and that's it guys that's you know those are the uh free assets for the month of june link in the description if you want to go ahead and get them um also you have noticed but maybe I, you know i'm trying a new uh format of videos for non-tutorial uh, videos and you know play around with less edition and, and, and things like that and i think it looks pretty pretty cool um with that said if you want to see a video of me discussing whether you should use assets or not in your games let me know in the comments below i have already done that but i want to get more in depth so let me know if you want to see uh you know a video of my opinion anyway with that said guys um if you found the uh, video interesting, I would really appreciate it if you could like the video and subscribe to my channel. I lots of Unreal Engine 5 videos and tutorials, so check them out. Um, join my Discord server, follow me on my socials, now yes, without saying bye, bye.